Hi everyone, this is Jean-Christophe Chouinard and today I'm going to show you how to install Python on Windows 10 machine. Uh, so make sure that you follow each step because installing Python can be tricky when done wrong, but it can be very simple when done right. So just make sure, don't skip ahead, just try to do each step very slowly, make sure that it's well installed and then go up ahead. So the first thing you want to do is you want to know if Windows has been installed. So you can search here for command prompt. And in the command prompt, you can write Python version to see if it has been installed. Uh, Python was not found, so what you need to do is you need to install Python. So what you can do is you can go here and search in your search browser for Python download. And what you want to do is you want to go to the Python uh, in, uh, foundation website and download the Python 3.11 the latest version of the Python. So now it's been installed. So what you want to do is you want to double click on the file. Here, what you want to do is you want to make sure that you will add Python executable file to the path. What this does is it allows Python to execute, uh, to find the executable file in the command prompt when you search for Python keyword. So if you don't do this, it won't be able to find it again. So what you want to do is you want to add to the path and then you can customize the installation. So this, okay, good. You install everything here. Maybe one thing is interesting here is to just uh, uh, install right at the root in order to make it more simple to, to access. This won't change anything but it's a good way to to install so let's pause for a moment while it downloads and come back yeah so now what you want to do here you can close this and you can come back to your command prompt uh again this way command prompt and you can type in python to see if it recognizes. and now you can see that python has been installed with the version that you were searching for so now you can do whatever you want to do you want to print uh hello world and then you can do this and then it prints so as you can see python has been installed and uh and you're good to go